Oh my god, I'm destroying you. <laughs> you suck. You're bad, bro. Like, actually. This is me. And to explain why I can't win fights, we're going to have to look at what is wrong with my gameplay. And well, I can't aim. I was never good at aiming, but I was determined to change that. And that's when I learned about Bridges Land Aim Trainer. This was the start of a journey that broke the human limit. In this aim trainer, there are three white blocks you try to hit spread out randomly in a 5x5 grid. Whenever you hit a target, it disappears and teleports to a new location, and you get 50 points. We hit a black target, and you lose 25 points. I was playing in a game where you had to hit as much as you can in 20 seconds, and that's when my mission began. I was terrible at the beginning, but I knew that becoming good was going to take me time, and I started to get good fast. Soon after starting, I got a score of 3,000. Nice! Which was already impressive for new players as you must get at least 60 hits in 20 seconds without a single miss, hitting at a rate of 3 hits per second. Then I started to drown. After a couple of hours, I was getting personal best after personal best. First, I started to consistently get a score of 3000, and that's when I realized the crazy possibilities of what is humanly possible. But first, I had to change some of my settings to make aiming easier. First, I changed my chest to pack a lot adding a less distracting sky, adding lightning and lunar to make it brighter, and changing the texture pack to make the world more distinct with a better outline. Time to explain how to break the human limit and to do the unthinkable and unbelievable. First, we have to understand what I'm talking about is hitting targets faster than the average blink. The average blink takes about 0.25 seconds to occur, and therefore 4 blinks a second, if we extend that for 20 seconds, is equal to 80 hits in that time, or a score of 4,000. This felt mind-blowing. The reason that seems insane is that in those 0.25 seconds, it takes the brain 0.1 second to process the image, which means that to go faster than a blink of an eye, you have to scan the whole grid to find all three boxes, react to the new position of the box, decide which box to go for, and move the mouse in that exact position, and click all in under 0.15 seconds, 80 times without messing up once. What makes this even harder is that because of a 60 hertz monitor, I only have 15 frames to do all of this, but because the server runs on 20 TPS, or ticks per second, which is how much a server up takes per second, I only have 5 ticks to do that whole cycle. Just to show how fast that is, I'm going to flicker a light on the screen and imagine that they hit a target faster than the light is flicking. This is going to take a while. I practiced for hours, getting a score of 3847 with 81 hits and 4 misses, and then 3,900 with a score of 71 hits and no misses. I was so, so close. Oh, let's go. I got a score of 3,950 with 80 hits and one miss, placing me in the top 100 in the world at rank 81, but still not good enough. During this time, I also got a top 100 in the world in the 30 second category as well. And then I kept on going, and after 10 hours, I did this. I hate that- that's still- The win percentage doesn't actually do anything, because like, it counts voided games as lost games. Which is like stupid. But that's why you have to look at like, the loss ratio, because that's Oh yeah, also after going like <gasps> Let's go! Okay, I just oh I just oh let's go. I was relieved. But I still think I could do better. So I decided that I needed to go for better. More dedicated hours passed as I got into the top 50 in the world with a score of 4176. Oh let's go! <laughs> let's go! Then 4,300 with the perfect 86 hits and zero misses. Finally, after countless hours, I did this. How did I get this?
goodness. Finally, 89 hits, perfectly with no misses. I had done it, becoming ranked number 20th in the process. The average blink takes 0.25 seconds, but I was able to go from the worst aim in the world to be able to hit targets in an average of 0.22 seconds, completing my goal. So how did this help me? Aim in mind tracking is split into two factors. How well you can flick to a target and how well can you track to the target. Overall, I felt the benefit of this aim turn almost instantly when I got a score of 3000. To measure how much this helped me, I'm going to be using the melee factor. Before this training, average a melee accuracy of around 20% to 30%. But after, I averaged around 50 to 60% melee accuracy and get plus 70% on good rounds, even once getting a score of 100%. My flicking has seen the best improvement as shown in this clip. I win a 1v1 with straight aim, break their bed. Now as they turn to throw away the materials, I see a yellow coming towards me. Try to attack the guy that just respawned, hit him, flick to the guy that was coming behind me. Flick back to the guy that just responded to see that he fell and flick back to win the two. That was the craziest flick I've ever done. Holy cow. I also got better at trick shotting Skyward's duels. Oh! That hit! Oh, I'm actually just so good. And that's how I broke the human.